fishing is for everyone. Today there are almost as many fishermen as there are fish. Fishermen cast into the roaring surf from the beaches. They drop baited hooks into the ocean depths as they ride anything that floats. The fever begins at an early age, and every jetty, dock, and pier has its complement of junior anglers. Everybody fishes. Even the birds get into the sport, and the most famous catcher of fish is the comical pelican, whose bill holds more than his you-know-what can. He has the power of a dive bomber and the accuracy of radar. Get out of here, you guys. Go get your own fish. Then there's this lucky cat. His boss is a fisherman, and that lunch is the result of an easy handout. Oh, well, easy come, easy go. Heading out for the blue water, fishermen are on their way for a day of sport. Right, and it's a dolphin. At last, the battle is won. A big bull dolphin, alive with every gorgeous color of nature's paint box. What delicious eating. Onward now in search of more fishing adventure. And here it is, some fun. You never know what's on the other end of the line. No telling how big these amberjacks can grow. In Hawaii, a world record 120 pounder was taken. Well, this one isn't a record breaker, but plenty big enough to thrill this angler. Speaking of tackle busters, this 1,560 pound black marlin is the largest yet taken on rod and reel. When you fish for monsters like these, you need special equipment. We might also add you need some money. Big game reels cost from $250 to almost $1,000. With all this equipment, what else would one need? A boat. And bait. Fish this size are the kind you and I bring home. To hunt giant marlin, a guide scans the sea. Sometimes a giant sperm whale is sighted. With this whale sunning himself on the surface, there'll be no marlin in these parts. So our captain moves on. A giant manta ray wings its way past the bow. But marlin territory is just ahead. strike. Old Stick Nose feels the steel and he doesn't like it. Now begins a grueling contest between man and fish, a struggle which may last for hours. He's too busy to smoke. That marlin requires every bit of skill and energy the angler can muster. This fish is mighty powerful, but the fisherman is a seasoned expert. He knows when to take in line and when to wait as he conserves his strength. A heart-pounding thrill of pitting tackle and brains against one of these magnificent warriors of the deep is a lure that calls these sportsmen back to the seas again and again. Now the battle is ending. Time for the gap. This is a critical moment when a slip could be disastrous. But the job is done expertly, and the beaten gladiator is dragged into the boat. There it is, a fish any man could be proud of. Beating him was not easy. There's great joy on this boat. 
Aboard another cruiser, they're still looking for that tackle buster. At last, they see something. A frog man. The way skin diving has been growing in popularity, you never know where these underwater sportsmen will pop up. This diver is well on his way toward a tasty lobster dinner. But we have other business to attend to, so off we go. This time, it is a marlin. The battle is on, and the great marlin soars into the air. According to the rules of the International Game Fish Association, the angler must whip his fish single-handed, but his swivel chair can be turned to keep him facing the fish at all times. Should anyone touch either the fisherman or his rod and reel while he's fighting the fish, he and the fish will be disqualified. Man, oh man, this one is really a brute. More than an hour has gone by since this fish was taken on, and he's still going strong. When tail walking failed to get him off the hook, he ran for it but not very far. The boat captain and the fishermen are working together like a team and outguessing Mr. Marlin every inch of the way. Another hour goes by and the strength of this wonderful fish begins to ebb. Instead of leaping now, he just wallows on the surface. The fight is over Victory for the angler is assured. This baby weighs in at 910 pounds, but the fisherman is already dreaming of the next time, of line whipping through the guides, and the joy of battle with that tackle busting marlin still swimming free in the depths of the sea.